I would say that the future of global governance, that many of the issues that the G20 needs to tackle need uh, rethinking of global institutions and G20 itself too. So I think that is the most pressing issue at the moment, thinking how uh, future of government will be in 10 years and how global institutions should adapt to a very different environment in some years to come. <laughs> That's a question that nobody wants to answer at the moment, but I think that there, is, there are two tensions. One is about whether to go more local or more global, and I think that there is a path for going more global in the way that we give answers to problems. So I think that how we get to that stage in which we can decide that some global issues need to be tackled at the global level, like, for example, the regulation of in, uh, artificial intelligence, I think that's a very pressing problem that needs to be tackled at the global level. So I think these type of problems would help to push the way for a more global way of thinking. And the other tensions, I would say, is about how we can accommodate what global institutions need to do and what citizens are pressing for. And I think there is a decoupling, to use Dennis Nowers' words, mm -hmm. of what people are expecting. They, are, they want immediate responses, they have their friends on WhatsApp and they have immediate answers from what they are talking on their everyday conversations and at the same time they have to wait for long-term responses to very pressing problems. So I think that decoupling between expectations of the people and what are the responses to those problems is a tension that will be uh, on this stage. I'm not going to give you the answer because I don't have it, but I think those tensions are part of the the way ahead. I think it's special for two reasons. The first one is that you have people from all over the world and from very different, uh, also different organizations, not, not only think tanks, but you also have business leaders, media leaders. So I think that diversity is very unique and I think it's one of the most amazing things of this uh, workshop on this uh, seminar. And I think the other one is that we are all the time trying to push for discussing the solutions and not only the problems, and we are full of uh, diagnosis about all that is wrong, but we are not thinking about ways to solve it. And I think that is the very ambitious uh, name of the uh, summit, but also I think it's the strategy of all the conversations, and I think that is very enriching and it's mm -hmm. fabulous.